Will innovators ever not be S tier? I mean, yeah. In the beginning of set 6, they were S tier. But then they nerfed it a lot. And then it wasn't S tier anymore. It was like not played for a bit and then it like settled in the A tier once people discovered the ice cream build. Alright, so we got Brand. He's a good item holder for Malzahar. We could do. I want to do the Arcanist one, but if we get the mutant stuff that wouldn't be so bad either what is the mutant it is synaptic holy cow okay we're we're gonna try to do the mutant malzahar it's my favorite one with blue buff because he just spreads the thing to everyone it's definitely a super spreader and that's an unstable evolution all right we're just going for this Okay, glove not horrible. That is a Cho'Gath, that is great. Right, get this, get this big boy in. We could even level up. Just so we could get like one or two stacks. He's also decent at like killing stuff, right? I'll do this then. So he's a Merc player, so we could save some HP this round by maybe even winning. Yeah, we. I think we win. No stacks, though. They did rework Rek'Sai. She just doesn't steal stats anymore or something like that, and then she heals more now. I think that was a change. A man's got two items from item grab bag, and they're both really good. He should have put both items on the same person, in my opinion. Just whoever's two star. Oh, we're not killing this guy. Ah, oh, he was about to heal if he got that and said his guy heals and then we kill no one. That's not fair. I, I don't think Rek'Sai- oh wait, no, Rek'Sai did get the heal off. Maybe he didn't get the second one? I don't know. I don't remember anymore. I don't actually watch the fights that closely. You should, because it's one way to get better. But so I just autopilot some games. That is a Zack, but I think we just make interest. Wow. I am too good at the video game. I'm one of those people that I scout and I immediately start hating them. The only difference is that when I scout them, they have a Malzahar 2 at this point. But, you know, I'll take it. I'll take it. <laughs> Probably don't need the zigs anymore. I started streaming like a couple months ago, but I just do it whenever I play now, if that makes sense. It doesn't happen every day, but whenever I can. Three gold, 28, not enough. Yeah, no worries, no worries. So the advantage of Malzahar is that he is so good in the early game. As the game goes on, I feel like he falls off compared to other carries, but what you do is you use the health advantage you have, and then use that to snowball into like high levels, and then use that to win. I'll protect from blitz hooks, why not? I want to think about trying to build a mutant spatula. Then maybe we could play like mutant Ari or mutant Renata would be pretty cool. 
USS, nah, we'll just stone plate. You don't have to slam the item. But realistically, like, of course you want, like, Bramble Vest or Titan Resolve instead, or you want, like, Ionic Sparks, not bad. Some some games you want Dragon Claw. We can do the Chalice, as I talked about before, but, I mean, how bad can Stone Plate be, right? It can't be horrible. Famous last words. Next turn, what do we want to put in? Striker, Colossus, Debonair? It doesn't matter what we put in. We'll just probably put in another... Rek'Sai or something, because he's a bruiser. But he gets the bonus health. Nice. I think we got one stack on the Cho'Gath. I wish there was a way to see how many stacks Cho'Gath has. We'll level up here, drop, drop the Rek'Sai in. Also, like, there's a Dunky video that came out when Rek'Sai came out, and it's titled, like, Rek Guy. I just think of Rek'Sai as a guy because of that. <laughs> but it's obviously just a play on words. I don't think the gender of Rek'Sai was known when, when Rek'Sai came out, though. I, I have no idea, like... Dude, I've been playing League for like so long, like I still mix it up, you know? At the end of the day, it's a alien video game character, so who, who really cares? No. Oh, come on, 35 life? And I miss out on interest? They are level 5, how did they win? I mean, it's obviously Mutant Heart, right? Meditation, I like a lot, but Mutant Heart will be able to run a lot more stuff. I mean, we're going Mutants, you have to take Mutant Heart, right? It's literally balanced around that. We lost to uh, Saucis. You're telling me this guy's win streaking and he didn't level up to level 6 last round? Holy cow. We'll level up. If I had a Cho'Gath pair, I'd probably roll. If I was like 46 life like this dude, I would have rolled as well on 3-2. But I only have a Malzar pair. Uh, oh no, the Swain lived with literally 2 HP and then he's gonna heal up. Wow. I need some damage on the Malzahar or something. Because that is not fair at all. And not to mention the Ionic Spark damage that was happening the whole time. That, that's not cool. That's not, not kosher at all. There's no rod. Uh-oh. I wanted the chain. I'll, I'll just get the Kazakhstan. No. I'll get the chain. Ah, that sucks. I feel like Chain's fine. I want a tanky Cho'Gath. Oh, sweet. Uh, 24 to level up. That is a little much for me. I need a Kassadin or something. Like, how have I not seen one yet? Did I skip a Kassadin? I don't, I don't think I did. Defense is me. I will do this, and I guess we could start rolling a little bit. Nothing. Nothing. Holy cow. Yep, the glass is half empty. Any mutant. Any mutant. Nope. I'm hard stuck on four mutants. But this guy... He has like six Morganas. I don't know. Doesn't seem very fair. Yeah, 
that that does not seem very fair to me at all. I got this at least, right? But please, can I get five mutant or no? Nah? I'm legitimately just not allowed to. It is in motion. I'd rather make the interest. Holy moly, like... <sighs> I must have skipped a Kassadin somewhere, right? There's no way I didn't. But I can't think of a time when I did. Not to mention my Cho'Gath died right before the Caitlyn snipe went off. Like, what the hell is this game all of a sudden? At least she died to that, right? Wow, 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 wow. That is crazy. Alright, let's get a belt and get a redemption or something. Like, I don't even know anymore. I'm just in shock. There's a Kai'Sa. Maybe I just get Kai'Sa. So I could get five mutant. Yeah, sure. Let's let's do that. I could just thieves her or something. Oh, now you come. A little late, buddy. Do I even want to go for this? So this guy's going for Cho'Gath. Is he? No, he's just doing bruisers. So I could roll for three stars. Oh, now you can. We'll do this because we're trolling a little bit. I'll keep him on my bench for fun. Do we have too many mutants? Yeah, everyone has a buff already, Umbrella, so it's pretty good, pretty good. At least they came eventually, you know? As much as I complained this whole game, they did come eventually. It was just like, I needed the 5 mutant during like late stage 3, early stage 4. But life doesn't <laughs> always work that way. I could transfer into a Renata if I take this. I don't really want these though. I could do High Roller just to get the three stars. Phalanx is probably good too. I think it's Phalanx. I mean, Mutant Crown's really good, because then I could replace Kha'Zix and Kastin, but... I don't know. It's probably the Mutant one. But the thing is, when you get the Mutant Spatula with this augment, you want to be running like Renata carry and stuff like that. But I kind of want to go for Malzahar 3. I just, I just like the unit more. But if you're playing for serious, you just take the mutant thing, level up to 8, roll down for Renata, sell the Malzahar, and then put the items on Renata. Not really. Who gets this? I have infinite cast Cassadin. <laughs> Let's put it on Rex side just for fun. <laughs> we'll just get uh, perma healing Rex side. Is Shiv good? Yeah, Shiv is good. But the thing is, I'd want Shiv on like Kaisa or something, but she already has an item. On Malzahar, I could build Shiv as well, but I want to save the third item slot. 
Melzar also already reduces people's magic resist, so it's not that necessary to reduce magic resist even more. Too late to run. Okay, so Rek'Sai did like no damage, but healed a lot. I should probably have all all in now. I guess I chill now. Because we're getting kind of low, so I need to all in some point because we're going to have three fights. So, But we hit this guy. Why is Malzahar here? I don't even have social light anymore. Holy cow, dude. I kind of griefed that for like positioning for a while then. Okay, good. We have Cho'Gath against Tom Kench. Perfect. Why is my Cho'Gath so squishy? I'm very confused. He like insta died with the Bramble Bess. Am I am I seeing that correctly? I mean, Draven is a thing. items. Um, there's a gun blade. I'll take that. There's also... We could IE Kha'Zix, but I don't, I don't care that much about him. He dies instantly. There's also the stone plate for Cho'Gath. Well, why did my Cho'Gath die? He has like... Two resistance items and 4,000 health. I know he's solo tanking and all, but I just, I believed in him. Who knows? Yeah, he has like 50% armor pen or 25%. I think it's 25%. VIP ignores 50%, but like it's still a lot of HP to go through, right? And Tom Kench doesn't do that much damage to him. I think it's reduced damage. Unless they, they changed something about it recently, I forget what. Like even this fight, he's got IEJG on Corky, and I have a Bramble Dust, but Cho'Gath still died in like a couple of seconds. Something's going on. Did they nerf Cho'Gath and I don't know about it? it is its motion. Maybe. Alright, I don't think we're hitting level 9. It is its motion. That's why I rolled down here. If I was- I should have rolled down the turn before. I should have realized I'm never hitting level 9 this game. And just like rolled to 0 at like 5-1. That's my my bad. I didn't realize the health totals for everyone was so low. Like, he still has 266 armor, right? I guess Draven reduces on his own. He doesn't actually reduce for his teammates. We still won, but... Uh, I just thought he was tankier, that's all. Actually trolling me right now. I'll put it on cast in. He'll just keep reducing. What do you call it? Yep. Glass is half empty. Follow my voice. Should probably play a seraphine for socialite. Yeah, maybe he didn't stack properly. Yeah, I normally think he does have more life. Okay. I almost died to the cave. Oh look, when my, my mouse doesn't get sniped for no reason, I, I beat him. Who would have thought? Too late to run. The trap claw helped a lot. Alright, we do have the social light hex now, so we'll play around with it. 
I'll roll down for Kaisa. I guess there was a small chance we could have hit level 9. But it was very small. We also have Phalanx, which makes it so Malice doesn't die to it instantly, so that helps too. Maybe that's why we're beating him. You got this, right? Nice. Oh, it's just a 1v1 against this guy. I know what I need to do. That's a start, but I need to just put someone in front. You should move over here so Caitlyn gets more range on my dudes. Whenever you're snipers, you want to be opposite side, not same side. Because you obviously do more damage the further people are away from you. And you just get less range when you're on when you're on same side. Okay, yeah, I don't even mind my Maltar getting sniped anymore because I have Phalanx. And my frontline blocked at that time. You know, Kha'Zix, I think, actually did work this game. It's Redemption. Could also go Challenger Spat. I don't know. Okay, I got Challenger Spat. Not horrible. Spamming mutants bad? I don't I don't think so. I mean like spamming it every game might be bad. But why would you spam it every game? <laughs> you could play it like every now and then, you know, I'm sure it's fine. Like if you get the right game for it. Okay, he wisened up, he moved to the other side. Even my Kassan lives through the ult. Wait, two things hit at the same time, no. That is most unfortunate. Because then my Malzar couldn't heal back up. We really needed a tank item for this guy, like holy cow. <sighs> Just a third one. You want a comp you can force every game? Uh, generally the four cost comps. Uh, probably you could probably do Renata. Nice. Can they kill this? Nice. It's gonna be a long game. Wait, he just gave up. <laughs> I guess we beat him like three times. We went four and one against him. He just needs to get lucky twice. He should have at least seen the item the next turn, but I won't complain. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to share and subscribe, and of course smash that like button. Each like is an LP I gained before the next video.